back to Holo Holo for your daily dose of Asian entertainment, Hollywood news, and celebrity insights. So this past weekend, the number one film was The Green Lantern. It's a superhero film based on a comic book series, and we have a very special guest, one of the actors. Ryan Reynolds. <laughs> Welcome. Thank you so much for being here Pleasure today. Pleasure to be here. Now, first, let's talk about your experience on the film. Uh, sure. Well, um, uh, I'm playing a um, the best friend character of uh, the Green Lantern. Uh -huh. Not Ryan. He's not my best friend. <laughs> I've got other best friends. And um, yeah, and so you know, my character is an aircraft engineer kind of tech geek who. Mm -hmm. um, who is uh, the Lantern's friend and, and confidant. And what was it like working on the film? Really fun. I mean, it was the first time for me working on a, a huge budget film mm -hmm. like that. And um, I'm normally a filmmaker, a writer, and a director, and my, yes. my budgets are a lot lower <laughs> than uh, the <laughs> whatever. The but you do. You know, I heard you have the highest grossing film in New Zealand. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. I do. Is I do. that how you got the role in this um, film? Yeah, my film uh, called Boy, it played at Sundance in 2010. And then uh, I guess the casting people from Warner Brothers saw the film and were looking for an actor who was neither black or white. <laughs> and uh, I think that's I fit you. the bill, yeah. So, so it all worked out for me. Did you have a lot of makeup or prosthetics that you had to put on for the uh, No, actually my hair, like this is sort of like a short version of my hair. And <laughs> it's kind of under control at the moment, but uh -huh. when uh, when it gets longer, it sort right. of explodes into sort of like a kind of puffy afro. And, yeah. um, but that was my normal hair, and then and I just wore glasses uh, for the role <laughs> because I think that's what uh, tech geeks wear. Mm -hmm. so Apparently, <laughs> according to the movie people. So how did you get started in acting? Um, I've been acting for a long time. I started off in theatre and did a lot uh -huh. of comedy and um, and wrote a lot of plays with a bunch of friends back in New Zealand. And right. I didn't really get into film acting until I was in my twenties. So you were more interested in directing, writing. Yeah, that happened a little bit after that um, uh -huh. when I realised that there's not a huge amount of roles in New Zealand for uh, <laughs> people to play. So I decided to make my own work and to yeah to tell my own stories. Which turned out really well because you did well. really good. Yeah. <laughs> you have yeah, a yeah. TV series in New Zealand too. Yeah, it's called Super City, and uh -huh. that, um, and that's just finished up back home, and we're hoping to. So try and bring that over here, like a version of it over here, and um, that's a one-woman show. Who, a girl who plays five different characters and uh -huh. just set around nice. Auckland, and it's <laughs> kind of dark comedy. But how did you come up good. with that idea? Uh, this is this girl, Madeline Sami, who's an incredible actor, and she um, she did a play once where she played like 22 characters and uh, flawlessly, and wow. so yeah, this was easy for her actually to play five. Yeah. yeah. So you are from New Zealand. I am. And you are now in LA. I'm now, yeah, between LA and New York, mm -hmm. and um, but I'm still a New Zealander, <laughs> and uh, yeah, I'm loving it here though. You know, it's great. Yes, and let's go back to the Green Lantern. What's the best part of filming the Green Lantern? Uh, the catering was pretty good, <laughs> and um, the waiting around was not the best part of it. Right. I think for me, just like seeing, uh, you know, seeing a set that big, you know, and seeing right. like just the coordination of all those people, like there mm -hmm. were just, you know, there was hundreds and hundreds of people involved, and. Um, and yeah, just crazy to organize special. something like that would be pretty crazy. And yeah, and yeah it's just a, a real eye opener for me as a right. filmmaker to, to watch that. And it was a pretty huge cast, right? I mean, Jeffrey Rush, Ryan Reynolds, Blake Lively. Yeah, Lively, yeah, you. yeah. I mean, um, even just to see those people on set was actually <laughs> quite a buzz for me. Um, mm -hmm. You know, in, even in some of the scenes, I when we were looking at people and thinking, wow, that's that, <laughs> that's that really famous person. Well, congratulations. I mean, number one film. <laughs> This yeah, weekend. well, yes. uh, I guess that's great. <laughs> <laughs> and for more information on you, where do we go? Uh, on me? Yes. Um, I guess Google. Uh, that's pretty much it. I don't have a site. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us today. Thanks for having me. It's been a pleasure. <laughs> yes, same here. And The Green Lantern is out in theaters now. Thank you so much for watching us. For more of Holo Holo, check us out on YouTube, youtube.com slash TV. Send me your emails, holoholo at la18.tv. And follow me on Twitter, twitter.com slash show. We'll see you later.